Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I am going to be talking about lasers for your face. It is going to be a Tria laser hot or not. One of these is hot, one of these is not. Which do I start with? I'm not sure. One I've only been using for a few months, one I've been using for I think two years. This one right here, it's good. I've actually put this in a favorites before so let me quickly just say this guy for your face, it's like $500. It will essentially resurface the skin a little bit. It's going to make your pores look smaller, fine lines fade, not fade, fine lines look less visible. It just makes your skin look really healthy and helps promote collagen production and somehow kind of tightens everything up as well. I'm a big believer in this guy. I think it is awesome, awesome, awesome. It kind of, you turn this on and it kind of Ooh, that kind of burns. Um, it's a little bit painful. I'm going to point that out right now. A little bit painful, a lot of bit expensive, but if you are a results driven person, you're like, I don't care. I'm going to spend one minute every night feeling like a rubber band is smacking me in the face because I want perfect skin. And this product is for you. It's perfect. Um, I'm probably exaggerating a little bit because I have like zero pain threshold. Let me throw that out there. I actually made James try this and he was like, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't feel anything. So for me, it's kind of stingy. And after I do the full treatment, I feel a little bit tingly. My skin is a little bit red, kind of like you got maybe a light sunburn, but that does go away. There's no peeling, no downtime, none of that. And I think it is a product worth checking out if you are someone really concerned with a bunch of different skin issues. Now, the item that I'm gonna say, watch out for, watch your back. Take a pause. Why am I so like this lately? Like, I'm just like, buyer beware. This item right here from Tria, this is what the box looks like or the cover of the box. This is the Age Define Eye Wrinkle Correcting Laser. It's for treatment of the crow's feet, basically over here, these lines right here. I mean, it's not like you're taking this over the eyelid. It's not like you're taking it directly under the eye. It really is to treat those fine lines over here from smiling, you know, crow's feet. Um, and this is something that you use every single night. It shows you pictures of before and after, and it shows you how to use it. I mean, you get everything you need in here. The laser light penetrates deep below the skin surface to stimulate cell renewal and to diminish hard to treat wrinkles and reveal more radiant, youthful looking eyes. This is going to target those wrinkles on the side over here. Don't use this on the eyelid. Don't use it directly under the eye. Problem that I had with this guy, which PS, this is $249. It is not an inexpensive tool by any means. The problem I had is that I find that it kind of almost drags a little bit. The tip of it is a little bit difficult to get a smooth kind of line over here. And while you're using it, it also vibrates, by the way. Turn on. Do it. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, that burns. <laughs> that is painful. I forgot how bad that was. Um, so it really kind of stings. It's like zapping the wrinkles right off my face. Uh, the issue I had was I actually burned myself and I feel like the skin underneath your eye is so delicate. I just, I wouldn't do this. I would leave those kind of treatments in the hands of the professionals and I would not mess with this area at all at home with a laser, even though they do sell it and it feels like, oh, this is so super safe. I feel like I'm someone that knows my stuff when it comes to skincare. And if I burned my under eye area, then that might happen to someone else. So I just wanted to throw that out there that my experience with this item was not that great. However, this one for the face, I've been using on and off for well over a year and I have never had anything but fantastic results. So that is my hot or not, one hot, one not. And let me know also if you are into me talking about skin devices because there are so many of them. There are ones that are like laser hair removal, um, grow hair more on your head with light therapy, anti-age with light therapy, get rid of acne with light therapy, firm your skin with all these weird frequency tools, and just let me know what you are most interested in. I am so totally game to try whatever out and do a review for you guys. So yeah, that being said, I hope that you enjoyed this week's Hot or Not. Please give it a thumbs up if you did, and I hope you're having a great day. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Mwah.